Hey guys, Josh Tufty here uh, with Edge Fitness and Combat Arts. I hope you all are having a great day. Um, if you guys are members of my gym in High Point, you've probably seen me gimping around the gym the last week or so. Um, this past week, I fell during a self-defense training session with a client awkwardly on my knee. Thought it was nothing major, just a little sore. Turns out it's something a little bit more serious than that, even though we're not sure exactly yet what it is. Um, they believe that I've got a class one or two tear to my ACL and my PCL, and then some sprains to my MCL and my LCL, things like that. We're waiting on the swelling to go down before we do a full set of images. But a thought occurred to me today that this might be a good opportunity because we get questions um, at the gym pretty often if I'm injured with my shoulder or my back or my knee, how do I stay active? What do I do to adjust my diet? Uh, what do I do to stay motivated, stay consistent, that sort of thing, uh, from clients that are just going through life, injuries, anything from twisted ankles to I jammed my wrist to more serious problems like I may have torn a tendon or ligament in my knee. So I thought I would start a video series, just short, two, three, four minute videos uh, that document some of the process that I'm going through to heal my knee, how I'm adjusting my diet, what I'm doing to modify the workouts because boxing and powerlifting, at least for the most part, are gonna be out for the foreseeable future depending on what the injury exactly is to my knee and how long that's gonna take. So hopefully my goal for this series is that you guys We'll take some tips and tricks and practical advice, um, knowledge maybe that'll help you in a current or future injury from this. Um, this is not meant to replace what a therapist says or a doctor says. It's just little tidbits to help you get through. I'll document what I'm doing to my caloric intake, how I'm adjusting my macros, what I'm doing with my strength training. We'll go over some of my therapy sessions. I'll got permission from some of my therapists to record what they're doing, some at home exercises that I'm doing to keep up the strength and the, the joint flexibility and the mobility in the legs and my back and my how I treat my other leg, that kind of thing. So hopefully you guys will find this helpful and I will see you guys very soon with the next installment in this video. Y'all have a great day.